Dear friends, Jay is here with you. I am going to let you see what the health club or our gym looks like. This is located in the sub-ground level of the Leonardo Royal City of London Hotel. You may have seen the videos about this hotel earlier on my channel. We have a hot tub in the background. I won't zoom too much because there are people in there, but you can see it's bubbling and it's pretty warm. I wouldn't say it's hot, hot. So we have a pool and the depth of the pool is 1 meter 20. The reason it's meter 20 is because it's designed for people of all swimming abilities. Uh, some people come here to exercise. Many people who stay in a hotel also come here. Uh, we have many tourists with children, small children, middle-aged children, teenagers. We have lovey-dovey couples. We have hardcore swimmers. We pretty much have all sorts. Of course, Monday through Friday is a little bit quieter. We usually tend to come between 7 and 10 in the evening because that's the least busy time. I will also show you some other facilities that are attached to this pool, which has three lanes and is 25 meters long. So the middle lane is designated for lap swimming only, although on the weekends when it's very busy, it's hard to do proper exercise. I'm going to pan down to the water um, to give you a little bit of a view um, and bypass the mirrors because uh, you don't need to see me in a swimming costume or Timothy for that matter. Not that we look bad, but it would be best not to capture that for the decency of the video and not to spoil your fun. So we have a little bit of a relaxation area here with the chaise longs. There are only eight of them here, so it's not too many, but we used to not have any at all. So this is better than nothing. This is our pool. So when sometimes I say we are going swimming, we're going to the health club, this is where we are going. Some other facilities that are available to us are aromatherapy room. So it's quite dark in there, it's quite warm. You just basically sit on uh, ceramic tiles and because it is aromatherapy, um, it smells very heavily of lavender is in there. So next to it is the sauna and uh, you can see the red light, so the very traditional looking um, room. So here's the door to the sauna. Uh, the door with the blue light behind it is the steam room. I'm not going to bother going in there because because you won't see anything it will just steam up and the last thing we have here is a cold shower the light is out of service we had some problems see we've got a light that fell out of the ceiling because we had the aircon broken and there's been a lot of steaming up going on for a week and that's why things are a little bit in the state of disrepair but the management had informed us that there would be um, some renovations going on although they would be done overnight so we would still be able to come and enjoy the facilities. So here's a little bit more of the sauna and just a slightly different view of the pool. So I'm very grateful 
that now towards the end of the day the pool is going to close quite soon as well as all the facilities they close at 10 but they stop letting people in at 9 30 in the evening um, so i am very happy to be able to show you the facilities in this hotel um, i can assure you that although we have about six hotels in the vicinity none of them have such facilities um, in this location we have one hotel that has such facilities even better but it is a six star hotel four seasons um, so unless you're prepared to pay uh, something like six or seven hundred pounds a night for the room you're not gonna get them this hotel uh, is also not very cheap but it is a lot more affordable uh, it's uh, billing itself as four stars um, and we are very lucky to be able to have membership into this health club. You will have seen the gym on the other side of the hallway and the Pilates room and the relaxation room. Um, and this is the last uh, bit, bit of the hotel that I wanted to show you of our health club. So when we say we are going swimming, this is where we are. This here is my favorite corner because I like to come down to the water and just sit under the water uh, when Tim is helping me to stay on the bottom. I find it very relaxing and uh, my best time of holding my breath on the water is 1 minute 15 seconds. So there you go. Uh, with this I'm going to sign off. I hope you liked the video and found it quite informative. Perhaps you will be visiting London soon or just to fill your curiosity. Either way, we're happy you're staying with us. Take care of yourselves and each other. Have a great weekend. Bye!